In these series of lessons, we'll be talking about task queues. We begin with having a regular setup of a message queue with the publisher and consumer. The purpose of the task queue is to be able to distribute the workload of one queue into multiple consumers. So let's take a look at this scenario where the publisher can publish 10 messages per second and the consumer can only consume one message per second. In this scenario, the queue will continue to grow as the consumer is not fast enough to, to consume the messages at the rate that the publisher is sending. This is known as a slow consumer problem. So one way to get around the slow consumer is to have multiple consumers consuming the same queue. So then the workload is distributed amongst those consumers. By having multiple consumers, we're able to consume the messages at a higher rate because we are able to dispatch multiple messages to multiple consumers. This is the general idea behind the task queue setup, to have multiple consumers to be able to consume messages at a higher rate than the publisher is publishing in order to not delay the messages from being consumed fast enough. In the following series of lessons, we will take a look at how to implement the task queues in RabbitMQ.